Hello everyone. So today we are going to solve another problem on SLA that is service level agreement. This is a this is an important topic in cloud computing CC. So let's begin. Suppose a cloud guarantees service availability of 98% at that of the time. Let a third party application run in the cloud for 18 hours a day. At the end of the month, 30 days, it was found that there were two outages of 5 and x hours. What is the maximum value of x such that SLA is honored? So in this, uh, one thing which we need to know is SLA is an agreement between the cloud provider and the consumer, that is the client, uh, about the minimum uh, service hours that the cloud service will be up so that uh, the um, charges can be accommodated accordingly. So for this first we will calculate the total outage that is the total downtime during which the cloud provider is unable to provide the services. It is as x plus 5 because there are two outages of 5 and x hours. Uh, after that we have the expected uptime. It means the uptime that sh should have been provided to the client. So it is 18 hours per day into 30 days. So for one month we are calculating one month. So that's why we are calculating this way. So it comes out to be 540 hours, right? If we multiply these two. But now comes the actual uptime which the um, client is receiving, which will be expected uptime minus downtime. So it is 540 minus x plus 5, which is the downtime we calculated above. So it comes out to be 535 minus x hours, right? So now we have the main formula for this problem is the formula for availability. So availability is defined as 1 minus downtime by uptime. Some of the students confuse this as uh, uptime should be like 24 hours into 30 days so this is not the case because uptime is calculated based on the amount of time the app is running inside the cloud so uptime is calculated exactly the way I have discussed above right so keep this in mind so we'll put the uh, values in the formula which is x plus 5 for the downtime and uptime is the actual uptime so it will be 535 minus x so this is the availability. Now to meet the SLA requirements, availability should be greater than or equal to 98% because if the cloud provider is unable to provide 98% of the uptime, it means that he has violated the SLA. So we need to ensure that the availability after uh, reducing the downtime from the uptime is greater than 98% or equal to 98%. But we are also given in the question to maximize the value of x. And if we see x is in the subtrahend of the part, it means that as we increase the value of x, the availability will decrease. So we need to equate both of these things and this will basically increase the availability and this reduces it. So both of them will have the combined impact and we can see that it reduces to this equality only because if the value of 1 minus this goes below 98 percent it means that the SLA requirements are no longer uh, means met. So it will be an equality and if we solve this right using basic uh, multiplication and basic uh, maths then we will get x to be as 5.588 hours so this is the answer to this problem i hope you understood what i tried to explain thank you